today we study system of linear equation from that non homogeneous system we have to solve this non homogeneous system by reduction method in that the first type is unique solution in this unique solution first we go through the one example having unique solution now we want to solve following example is the following system of equation consistent if so solve it the equations are x plus y plus z is equal to 6 x minus y plus 2z is equal to 5 3x plus y plus z is equal to 8 2x minus 2y plus 3z is equal to 7. Now to solve this system, first of all we want to convert this system into the matrix form. To convert this system into the matrix form, we have to write coefficient matrix, unknown matrix, and the constant matrix. So. we start with the matrices so solution of this example system of equation in matrix form in matrix form so first of all in coefficient matrix we have to write down coefficient of x in first column coefficient of y in second column coefficient of z in third column so the coefficient matrix is coefficient of x in first equation is 1 coefficient of x in second equation is 1 coefficient of x in third equation is 3 coefficient of x in fourth equation is 2 similarly the coefficient of y in first equation is 1 coefficient of y in second equation is minus 1 coefficient of y in third equation is 1 coefficient of y in fourth equation is minus 2 coefficient of z in first equation is 1 coefficient of z in second equation is 2 coefficient of z in third equation is 1 and coefficient of z in fourth equation is 3 so this is nothing but our coefficient matrix now we want to write down variable matrix here we have the three variable x y and z so the variable matrix is x y z is equal to we have to write down the constant matrix so the constants are 6 5 8 7 now this can be written in the form of augmented matrix an augmented matrix is a combination of coefficient matrix and the constant matrix so and augmented matrix can be written as capital a slash b is equal to our coefficient matrix Y 
वन वन थ्री टू वन माइनस वन वन माइनस टू वन टू वन थ्री एंड कॉन्स्टेंट मैट्रिक्स सिक्स फाइव एट सेवन नाउ टू फाइंड आउट द सोल्यूशन ऑफ दिस सिस्टीम वी हैव टू कन्वर्ट दिस अगमेंटेड मैट्रिक्स इन टू द रो इकेलॉन फॉर्म नाउ टू कन्वर्ट दिस इन टू द रो इकेलॉन फॉर्म मीन्स वी हैव टू कन्वर्ट ओनली द कोफिशियंट मैट्रिक्स इन टू द रो इकेलॉन फॉर्म नाउ फर्स्ट जॉब इज टू फाइंड आउट द लीडिंग वन सो फॉर फर्स्ट कॉलम our leading one is the first entry so once we get that by using that leading one we have to make the below entry zero so for that the row operations are simple so now convert the below entry zero means r2 r3 and r4 the corresponding row operations are R two minus its entry is one into corresponding leading row is R one comma R three minus its entry that is three into leading row is R one. See, leading row is R one because our leading one is from the first row. Now to make the R four entry zero, that is two. The row operation is R four minus its entry two into R one. So by applying this row operation, we get the following entries. It is one, one, one. Now, whenever you are applying the row operation, first of all, write down the rows on which we are not applying any row operation. By doing R two minus R one, we get zero minus two, one minus one. For third, we get zero minus two. Minus two, minus ten, and the last row we get zero, minus four, one, minus five. Now after this, we have to apply row operation to get the zero into the second column. to get the zero into the second column we consider our leading row is r2 so this is what our leading row this is what our leading row Now to make the below entry zero, the row operations are again R three minus R two comma R four minus two R two. So by applying this row operation, we get. New entry as now here we are not applying any row operation on first row and second row. So first of all we write first row one 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 six second row zero minus two one minus one third row is zero zero minus three minus nine. Fourth row is 
जीरो जीरो माइनस वन माइनस थ्री नाउ इन द थर्ड कॉलम we already have the minus 1 so we interchange third row with the fourth row because for the leading one it is simple to do the calculation by using minus 1 so here we have the minus 1 so we interchange fourth row with the third row so the next row operation is r 3 4 now applying this row operation we get new matrix is 1 1 one, 1 6 then 0 2 1 1 0 Zero minus one minus three, and the below end reads zero zero minus three minus nine. Now we have to make this entry zero. Now to make this entry zero, we have to apply the row operation. Is R three minus sorry, it is R four minus three times R three. So the new matrix is one one. One, one, six. Second row zero minus two one minus one zero zero minus one minus three zero 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 zero. Now here we want to find out. rank of this matrix what is the rank of matrix rank of matrix is nothing but number of non zero rows now in this matrix first one is non zero rows second is also non zero row and third is also non zero row so for this particular case rank is so rank of ab is equal to rank of a is equal to 3 that is number of unknown so therefore for this particular system has unique solution now to find out this unique solution we have to resubstitute the values now how to resubstitute the values see from r3 we get 0 0 minus 1 and minus 3 so this is corresponding to x y z and th minus 3 is a constant So if you multiply zero with x, we get zero x plus zero y minus z is equal to minus three. That implies z is equal to three. So this is from R three. Similarly, from R two, we get x, y, z corresponding value zero. Minus two one and constant is minus one. So the equation is zero x plus zero, not zero. Sorry, it is it 
इट इज माइनस टू वाई प्लस जेड इज इक्वल टू माइनस वन वी ऑलरेडी नो द वैल्यू ऑफ जेड दैट इज थ्री सो माइनस टू वाई प्लस थ्री इज इक्वल टू माइनस वन एंड दिस इम्प्लाइज माइनस टू वाई इज इक्वल टू माइनस जेड एंड दैट इम्प्लाइज वाई इज इक्वल टू टू सिमिलरली फ्रॉम आर थ्री वी गेट एक्स वाई जेड वन 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 कॉन्स्टेंट वैल्यू सिक्स इम्प्लाइज एक्स प्लस वाई प्लस जेड इज इक्वल टू सिक्स so by substituting the values of y and z we get x plus 2 plus 3 is equal to 6 implies x is equal to 1 so therefore solution is x is equal to 1 y is equal to 2 and z is equal to 3 so for x y z we have a unique value so therefore for the system we have unique value if you are not able to understand the row operation then search for a row operation by rahul jaywant abhang in youtube Thank you very much hope this video help you to understand how to solve the linear system by reduction method thank you again